So here we go. Now we are gonna fine tune our Flan T5 model with Hugging Face Accelerate. So as always, we start with a git clone command of uh, our Hugging Face Transformer repo. Yes. And then we are gonna install our Hugging Face datasets, our evaluation script. Rouge, you know this as a specific benchmark for summarization tasks. And it is up and running, done, done, done. And then we do need here to install transformers again from source because we need the latest version. And we are not happy with version 426, but we have to go for 427 to include here the latest code. Therefore, we have to install from source again. I know. Just waiting for the execution to finish. Come on. Let's go for it. As you can see here with our transformers, our git clone command, we have now Docker. No, 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 we are going for, we are going for examples. And within examples, we have here our legacy. This is here from end 2022. And we go, of course, PyTorch. And then we go here, not for speech. No, not for multiple, not for question answering, but we go here for summarization. And here's our fail. Here we go for run summarization. Beautiful, this file we're gonna execute in a second. So we have now transformer. No, we don't need you. No, this was the last video already. No, my goodness, no. Geez, oh, stop, stop here. NVIDIA, okay, we have a T4. We have a T4 confirmed. No, I don't want you to execute this cell either. So here we go, accelerate. This is what we need, hugging face accelerate. So for multi GPU configuration on your cloud platform, or if you have a local supercomputer somewhere, here we go. Yes, you will see that the accelerate configuration here is not working, I'll show you this here. Normally you would go here with your error keys, but I, as you can see here, I cannot make it work at all. So this here also we have to stop. And then, yes, thank you. I know this is not working. And do I have here, just hold on a sec. No, it's impossible. I can't have here any, no, I have to upload this. Accelerate launch. Yes, there's everything is missing. The config file is missing. So I have to put forward here, where are we, here, uh, for Accelerate, uh, uh, my specific config file for the infrastructure configuration of Google Colab. So you see, I upload here my config file for my Google Colab configuration. We have one T4 Tesla, I know this. Unfortunately, we have only one GPU from NVIDIA here. So, and as you can see, he tells me, hey, if you just do this command, and this is beautiful, launch accelerate config file and the path to your config file, he tells us, hey, wait a minute, the following arguments are required, a training script and the training script arguments. Well, of course, and here we go. Just wanted to tell you before we ex execute accelerate, you can use this for a CPU only setup. You can use this as we do it here in a setup with one GPU, you can use it, and this is the main course, in a distributed training environment where you have several GPUs. And of course, since we're operating here on a Google platform, you can use this for your small little beautiful TPU tensor processing unit cluster. But so this is it. So here, beautiful. Now we go, accelerate, launch, take my config file, this is the path to my config file. And then execute, please, here from Hugging Face, PyTorch, G. Too much information. Here, the run summarization Python file. This is what we have with our git clone command, so no problem at all. And then we say the parameters are, we want to have a flan T5 base model. This has already been uh, fine-tuned in my last video here on the SAM SUM dataset. I showed you in my last video in detail. We coded this. It is available on Hugging Face by Philip Schmidt. Then we want to do the training. We want to do the evaluation. I give you now a new task. 
This is now an XSUM dataset that I give you, and we have now also a further summarization task. Since we are working with T5 models, you have to provide the source prefix, you remember, the source sequence and the target sequence. I have to source prefix summarize. And I give you the output directory and I tell you the batch size. And I tell you, hey, since we are here operating on a free Google Colab GPU, we have to run with floating point 16, half precision, not with full single precision FP32, but we go with FP16. And I think this should be it. Let's have a look here. GPU, RAM, system, RAM, disk, everything is flatlining. So here we go. Now, the nice thing you can see here, maybe let's do this one here. He tells us now all the parameters. We have one GPU. I know, I'm so sorry. Then we have here the training parameters. We have here Google Brain floating 16 is false for the moment. We'll show you in our next videos how we can optimize further our performance. We have the data loader. Yes, deep speed. Yes, this is my next video. And FP16 is true. Yes. And then we have what a gradient checkpoint. No, you could push it to the hub if you want to publicize your model. But hey, this, we are just doing some demonstrations. So I'm not going to make this public in any way. But if you used the fine tuning, why not make it public for other people? The logging information, your learning rate scheduler, everything you know. <laughs> Push to up ID, your token. So yes, 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 your TPU metric, your TPU number course. If you have a TPU cluster, your warm-up ratio steps, decay functions. So everything you know and you love. And as you can see, we are currently here downloading data. And we are downloading here our test data, our um, test data set for the fine-tuning task of an already fine-tuned Flan T5 base model. Jesus, what a sentence. And it takes about 14 seconds now for the test generation split. And then I think when we do the mapping, you remember, we have to prepare to pre-process our data in a certain uh, size where we have tabs and where we have now the batch applied to an optimization. It is downloaded, downloading tokenizer. Here comes our tokenizer up, beautiful. Yes, download this tokenizer. Loading special tokens, configuration JSON. Yes, beautiful. Here we have our model with one gigabyte. Yeah, this takes about one minute. But here you see this is nice here, as I told you now, the specific prefix. Here for the summarization task, and this is exactly what we're going to do, you have to prefix summarize. But if you have translation English to German, you have this prefix. English to France, you have this prefix. So the system tells you how you have to more or less um, conclude which prefix to use. Yes, we have a very bad internet connectivity, as you can see here. So we are just waiting for the gigabyte to download. Gee, half a minute. Okay. As you can see, system RAM is fine. We are just downloading everything we need. No real calculation started till not. So, and after the model, I see the mapping exercise will start. Yes, we are running 427. Isn't this beautiful? Tokenizer on training set. So here we are now. Running tokenize on training set, and you see we have here five minutes to wait because our training data set for the fine tuned task is more than 200,000 single elements. So this takes some time with our tokenizer. So now we have the time that I can show you accelerate. You go to hugging face, you go to accelerate, you can search the documentation, you have installation quick tour overview. Everything, everything, everything. Just to show you, Hugging Face Accelerate is a library, maybe make it a little bit bigger, that enables the same PyTorch course code to run across any distributed configuration by just adding four lines of code. We just add one line of code. In short, training and inference at scale made simple, efficient, and adaptable. Remember DeepSpeed? Yes, you know it now. 
So you import your accelerator and then here in PyTorch, here it goes. Yes, 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 you have the tutorials, how to do guide, reference, technical reference. Let's have a look at the overview. Well, this is a short overview, mitigate launch code, how to do codes, start here. Yeah, and this show you now accelerate code, if you're really hardcore. We use here in our model, the trainer class from Hugging Face. So this is it, the accelerator itself. Quick adapt your code, yes, yes, yes. So let's see where we are now. Still two, three minutes to go, so I will be back with you in about three minutes. And as you can see, we are back now. We just have 24 hours to go for our training. But you know the nice thing here, our GPU RAM here, 13 gigabytes of 15, so we're here stable. We're running on a free Google Colab notebook. Isn't this amazing with a single Tesla T4 GPU? And you can do the fine tuning here. As I showed you, as I showed you, hold on a sec, as I showed you here on a Flan T5 base model, you fine tune here this on this single GPU configuration. Now, of course, if you want to go here in a multi GPU environment, it is so easy to adapt your configuration file for here, Hugging Face Accelerate and you have an optimal multi-GPU setup where your 24, 25 hours fine-tuning time will be crushed, of course. The more GPUs the you, you use, the better. So a great code, a great little piece of code by Hugging Face for multi-GPU or multi-TPU setup. And this is the way you can use it. I hope you enjoyed it. Please go experience and come back to the next video.